Good morning, first graders. It's Miss Fields. I'm back to teach you a new story element. So we have been learning about characters and setting, and we've been using the book Rainbow Fish. Today we're going to talk about the problem. Remember when we do our chant, we go like this, problem. That's because there's an obstacle or a challenge in every fiction book that the character goes through. So the problem is the character struggles with something. If I think about Rainbow Fish and I think about the main character, Rainbow Fish, in this book, what is Rainbow Fish struggling with? What's the problem in the story? I know that she doesn't want to give away her fins, but I think the real problem here is that she doesn't have any friends. Isn't she longing for some friends? So I'm going to take a post-it note. This time I'm going to put P for problem and I'm going to write Rainbow Fish had no friends. That's the problem. So here's my post-it note right here on my book. I'm going to challenge you today to use the same book that you used for the last two days. And I want you to work this time on writing the problem on a post-it note. So what in your story is the character struggling with? What is an obstacle that the character is trying to overcome? Let's do our chant one more time before we leave today. Ready? Knee ears on. In every fiction book, there will always be characters, setting, problem, solution, beginning, middle, end, and a lesson learned. Knee ears off. Great job, first graders. You are ready to get all nice and cozy, stack up your books, big and tall. Make sure you put your book from the last couple days right on top of your stack so that you can read it again and write the problem before you go on to your next book and read more and more. Have a great time reading. We'll see you soon.